Good evening, folks. I know that this lockdown has felt like the longest day, but things are starting to re-emerge, and you'll be aware that churches have been given permission to gather for worship from the 29th of June. Our elders will be meeting next week to make preparations. We won't be returning on the 5th of July. We want to take time to make sure that everything is in place for the safety and well-being of everyone. I write to our church family next week with the details of when and how things will happen. Meantime, please pray that we would have all the wisdom and understanding that we need for this next phase. In Psalm 69, David emerges from a time of great difficulty and he writes, I will praise the name of God with with a song. I will magnify him with thanksgiving. This will please the Lord more than an ox or a bull with horns and hooves. When the humble see it, they will be glad. You who seek God, let your hearts revive. For the Lord hears the needy and does not despise his own people who are prisoners. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you for your presence with us and your provision for us through the last weeks. Thank you for your wonderful promise that you hear the cries of those in need and you care for those who are locked up and locked down. Grant us wisdom and patience for the next steps. In your mercy, Lord, and in your time, may our hearts indeed be revived as we sing a new song together in your presence. In Jesus' name, amen.